Hi, it's Queasy and in today's video I'd like to talk about love. So love is a great thing for as long as it lasts obviously. Yeah, it depends the person you're in love with. If you're in love with someone that loves you, then that's great. If you're in love with someone with big tits, then that's great. If you're with someone if you're in love with someone that doesn't mind if you cheat, that's great. Some of the best parts for me personally of being in love is that you get guaranteed sex 24/7, bro. All right, so that's great. That's great. That's a that's some next level bonus, bro. Like you get guaranteed sex 24/7, okay? Because the person you're in love with loves you back, okay? Which is a top benefit, okay? Do you ever like you know like when people say they love being single? It's really a lie, okay? Like no one really wants to be out there trying to get laid. The other good part of being in love, as in being in a relationship with someone else, is that people see you and they like you. Like girls like guys that are in relationships. I don't even know why, why that is, man. Like girls just love you when you're in a relationship. It's like, they're like, he's my husband. He's my future husband in their heads. That's how they see it. That's, I don't know why girls are like that. Like in their heads, they think you're their one and only true love. Okay, which is great. So that's something that I always like. You know, when you get in a relationship and you you put it on the social network and everyone's like, oh, 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 and all the slags that you used to shout back in the days against trees pop up on you saying, oh, congratulations, you're in a relationship, blah, 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 blah. But really. They just want to fuck you now because you're in a relationship and you're fuckable and you're desirable and all that stuff, which is great. So being in love is actually great for more sex life with different people. It's weird because you get in because you get in love to stick to one person, but then before you know it, you have so many girlfriends. You change them every weekend because every girl thinks you're cute because you've got a girlfriend. Wow, life, bro, life. Another good part of being in love is that you can convince yourself that you're not a slag. Like, I'm not, listen, I know so many girls out there that think they're not slags anymore because they're in love with this local drug dealer, okay? So in their heads, that makes perfect sense. So in their heads, they believe that they are better off now and they're not slags because they are in love, which is good. I mean, denial is not bad at all. It's better to think, it's better to think like that instead of thinking that you're a nasty slug who blows people off for free drugs. It's a lot better, isn't it? It's a lot better than being that girl that just blows off everyone off and because that will keep you up at night thinking that you're that type of girl that just goes anywhere and all you can see you look at guys and all you see dick 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 you know what I mean? Another good part of being in love is that you feel happy all the time. You know that full that nice warm feeling you get when you're in love with someone. It's like it's not fully vulnerable, but it's like that warm feeling you always think, feel when you think about the person that you're in love with. Like seriously, that's the best feeling in the world. There's no feeling that can beat that. Like every time you think about that person that you love, it's just so great, man. It's just that like, you feel so warm and all the time, man. That's the good. That's the best thing, man, about being in love. Wow, I miss being in love. I haven't been in love since centuries, bro. It's messed up. Another good part of being in love is that you get free food. So if you're a girl and you get this guy to think that you actually love them, you can get free food. I know so many girls that do that, man. Like, there's a thing about girls telling guys that they love them that gets guys so gassed up to the point that they'll actually do all these random things for you. Oh, girls, man. I know this girl that always tells guys that it's her birthday, so she'll get with a different guy like every month. Tells the guy it's her birthday. It's her birthday. So imagine you've just got with the guy. Of course, if you tell him it's your birthday, he's gonna go out there and get you the best thing because you've just got together. He hasn't shagged you yet. He's desperate. He's gonna go out there and blow money. So that's what she used to do. And then after a month, she would leave that guy, find another one, tell the new guy that oh, it's my birthday next month. Until people found out that she was doing that stuff and they spilled acid on her. I feel sorry for her. She's still pretty though, but just a bit retarded pretty and stuff like that I'm joking she's not retarded or acid not acid she's okay she's actually successful now she goes to different countries where she tells people that it's my birthday because now everyone in the UK knows her little game so we all got used to her game now she knows everyone knows her around here Fuck knows when she runs out of places to go to lie about her birthday maybe she'll move to Mars maybe she'll be the first slag to go to Mars 
telling people that it's a birthday. <laughs> you have to learn alien, man. But yeah, that was it from today's video. So those are some of the good parts, obviously, of being in love, man. You have a good power of being in love. You don't have to use protection, man. Of course, of course, you're probably gonna get AIDS, but the good thing about when you're in love, man, you don't see stuff like that. You don't see any negativity. You don't see any little AIDS out there, okay? So you just shag your girl no protection all the time because you don't have you don't you don't care all right you don't love gives you that feeling that everything's safe but everything's safe so you don't need protection but then until you go to hospital and they tell you that you have stds and some undiscovered stds and then that's when you know you're fucked but obviously as long as you're in love who cares a little stds will not hurt love is the best man yeah but that was it from today's video peace